Welcome back. Look at all that slow moving traffic just to the corner of your screen. This is headed north on I-5. It was just from a few hours ago before the start of the closing act for the first night of the Aftershock Music Festival. There are three days left of the festival happening at Discovery Park. More than 160,000 people are expected to attend the four day event. Two out of three of them are coming from out of town. Our Devin Truby talked with some of them tonight. Rockers coming from around the world. Got to get off the island sometimes. People from 35 different countries are expected to attend the four day festival. 65% of people won't be from Sacramento. Santa Maria, California. Covina, California. 100 bands will take the stage over four days. Concert goers willing to do anything to make the show. You know, three years running, he skipped school and he skipped work. I lied to get here. <laughs> Fans like Daniel on a redemption tour to see their favorite band. So I was supposed to go to see Avenged Sevenfold in high school and uh, it fell through because I had a C in math. And so it got canceled. That was a big bummer. An opportunity to showcase Sacramento and bring in millions of dollars. Honestly, much better than I would have hoped for. I mean, pretty nice. Was in Midtown and kind of like biked around and pretty nice. Fans saying they can't imagine the event being anywhere else. You have a lot of staples here in California where rock has just been a part of it for ever. So why not keep it here? Why not keep it in Sacramento, the capital of California, right? It's, it's great. Yeah, certainly a huge draw. That was our Devin Truby reporting. And there's another festival headed to Discovery Park next week. That's the Country Music Festival, Golden Sky. 